Coats Bangladesh Limited, Gajapur, Dhaka. Existing factory is on 2.28 acre of land. Gajapur factory of Coats Bangladesh Limited started journey in 2002. The capacity and facilities upgraded over the years. Current dyeing capacity of 15 ton per day and finishing capacity of 40k clue per day. effluent treatment plant. It is based on a biochemical process of ink capacity of 1080 meter cube per day. The plant is 12 years old and is an expansion of the original plant installed in 2002. Engineering and utility shed. Existing process flow. Future expansion projects. Strategic projects have been initiated for factory expansion in end of 2016 with a lease land of 5.32 acres. Die house extension project. 9,000 square feet of a new steel structure building for extension of existing die house. The old die house building has been retrofitted with the new die house. The die house layout will be re-engineered with this new building along with material flow in 2018 to 2019. The die house will be able to accommodate about 35 tons of dyeing with necessary machine park change in future. New warehouse project. This will resolve a long-standing issue of compliance. 50,000 square feet off a new steel structure building, target project completion in Q4, 2018, and shifting in Q1, 2019. Finish good storage capacity of 4.4 million cone. Raw materials storage capacity of 630 ton. Multiple sizzle lift and spiral conveyor to support faster delivery service. The building design considering natural ventilation and daylight facility. Advanced level of fire detection and protection system conforming to Zurich guideline and in NAFPA standards. All windows will have low emission glass for energy savings. New gate and security control. Truck and bicycle parking. New process flow. The rainwater is collected from roof and injects through soak wells to the water table. Fire water tank of 1000 meter cube capacity supported by fire pump room and other ancillary facilities. New effluent treatment plant. ETP project. New ETP plant of capacity 1600 meter cube per day and upgradable to 2100 meter cube per day. Also kept as a liquid discharge option with evaporators in future if required. The technology will be based on biological membrane bioreactor plus reverse osmosis. Coats accommodate LED lights and solar powered street lamps. Reverse osmosis unit. ETP work will start in Q4, 2018 and finished by 2019. There will be 35% water recovery at stage 1, limited by the local TDS discharge limits. 
It will be compliant with codes category 1 and also with local discharge regulations if that is made more stringent over existing. Solar panels at ETP rooftop with protection rail. Final winding floor expansion project. Engineering and Utilities Shade Expansion Electrical Substation Modification and Upgradation for Compliance Reasons in 2017 to 2018 New Air Compressor in 2018 Exhaust Gas Boiler Economizer in 2018 and Accommodate Future Utilities Chemical Storage Shade LPG system for energy savings as a backup of diesel fuel. Delivering today, transforming for tomorrow.